What it do, man? It's your boy Marcel P. Black. Live in the most ratchet days in I've ever been to in my life in uh, Denver, Colorado. Um, I'll tell y'all more about that later, but um, I kind of want to. Uh, oh, I'm on the Black Experience tour uh, with Lyrics and Lyrics. You know what I'm saying? We're having a good time. We're actually about to leave to go do a show probably in a couple of hours or what have you. We're just chilling right now. We're on some downtime. You heard me? But um, so last night I had this crazy, crazy dream that I was able to sit down and chop it up with Dr. Dre. Like, you know. NWA, Dr. Dre, Aftermath, that guy. And it was wild because it's like, I be having crazy dreams anyway, so I get up, me and my dad out there chilling. I don't know where we are. And I get up, and I'm about to go dap down who I think he is, Denzel Washington. And by the time I actually dap him down, he turns into Dr. Dre. Like, oh, okay, cool. So, I don't know what that's about. But I talked to him, and uh, I played him some of my music. And he said, I really, really, really like what you do. But he said, you got a whole lot more hard work to do before people really feel it. I said, what do you mean? He's like, I still don't, he's like, with all the energy that you put in your music, I still don't think that, like, you're putting everything you have into it. And for some reason, people are not connecting with you. I'm just like, well, what do I do? He was like, man, for one, you have to go in the studio and have this mindset that what you have to say is the most important thing in the world. And you do anything to get people to understand it or what have you. And, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you can't care about what people are going to say. Like, he pretty much told me, like, and maybe this is my self-conscious talking to myself, but he pretty much told me, like, look, you're going to get hated on, people going to talk bad about you, but you'd have to worry about that. You have to just do music pure from your heart, you know what I'm saying? And just and just really, really try, try, try hard as you can to take your time to make it the best you possibly can. Um, now, I mean, that may seem like simple advice, you know what I'm saying, but... I feel like we in, we in the era of where, you know what I'm saying, rap music is more of a means to an end as opposed to people actually creating art from their hearts. You, know, you dig what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, I, I think, I mean, I feel like it's important for me to tell y'all that so you don't get any misconceptions about what I'm trying to do. Now, yes, I am trying to make money, but, I mean, for me, this is way bigger than hip-hop. It's way bigger than rap music. Like, I really have something to say, and, like, this is, like, a third of my heartbeat. Like, if I don't say this, I'm not the man who I am or whatever. And like, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, that's just pretty much it. It ain't, it ain't necessarily too profound, but who else has a dream with Dr. Dre and you having a real conversation with him? Straight up. Uh, that's what it is, though. Marcel P. Black, Room Music. I'll be back in Louisiana in a couple of days. Uh, my last show on the Black Experience Tour is going to be New Orleans at the Sound Clash at the Maison. Um, then I'm going to sit down for a little bit. I Love Her Too was finished. It should probably be out at the end of the month. Or maybe like the first, second week in August. That's what it is. I like my hobby, freedom.